Our city preparing to commemorate 50 years since the start of the Vietnam War, honoring soldiers who served with a unique look at what the war was like. And as our Casey Geraldo's here now to explain, music actually plays a pretty important role in this story. Very much so. Almost surprisingly, thanks to developments in technology, this was the first war where soldiers had music to carry them through. I talked with one man, both a veteran and a scholar, about the role it played. These are the sounds of war. But in Vietnam, this was also a popular sound. An anthem. We wanted to get out of that place to quote a song. Vietnam veteran Doug Bradley has spent years quoting songs, talking to veterans about their soundtracks to the war. Everybody's got their song. Um, a guy whose wife's name was Gloria. I mean, and he, he missed her terribly the whole time he was there. Glory is his song. Bradley and co-author Craig Warner talked to hundreds of veterans for We Gotta Get Out of This Place. They found a song isn't just a song when you've been through something like this. It became a throughway and a passageway for a lot of people to be able to talk about their Vietnam experience, their music-based memory. It has this enormous power whether it was when they were going over or when they were there, when they came back home or all three. These pages tell the story of soldiers connected to home, sometimes only by song. Radio was our internet. 50 years later, Bradley says events for the book help veterans share their stories for the first time. A man or woman will get up a Vietnam vet who has never spoken about something in 40 or 50 years and they'll share a moment with us. Tomorrow's memorial event goes on from 5 to 9 p.m., beginning with a discussion about the book. It's a very important sense memory. You hear something, it can take you back to a time or a place exactly. immediately. Casey Geraldo, thank you so much.